In a stark reminder of Soviet repressions, Russian authorities have given the Crimean Tatar's governing body, the Medjulis, 24 hours to vacate its headquarters in Simferopol. The building is owned by a charitable organization, the Crimea Fund. If it does not comply, it could be subject to criminal prosecution. The head of the Crimea Fund believes Russia's crackdown is motivated in part by a desire to take down the Ukrainian flag, which sits atop the Medjulis building. Tatars make up 10 percent of Crimea's population and have been one of the most vocal groups against Russia's illegal occupation and annexation of the peninsula. The notice of eviction comes just days after police officers and masked men in military uniform raided the Medjulis. Since Russia took control of Crimea, Russian authorities have banned many Tatar community demonstrations. Russia also banned the longtime leader of the Tatar community, Mustafa Jamilov, from entering the peninsula for at least five years.